All right, this is how to change your reverse light switch on an NV4500. This is on a 96 Dodge 3500 with a 12 valve Cummins. This is what your reverse light switch looks like. It takes a 7 8 socket. I got it on a half inch drive. And you also got a small little gasket that goes between the switch and the transmission. So you're going to take your 7 8 drive socket, which I've already loosened it up. You're going to disconnect this switch, which is above. I get a shot of it. I don't think my camera's going to pick up on it, but the switch comes off. It's a little connector. Lift up on the connector. You're going to take your 7 inch drive socket and loosen that bad boy up. It should go right over it. You need a, a deep well socket to reach it. It comes off. Voila, I do not have reverse lights. So we're going to put the new gasket on the switch. <laughs> Make sure that there's no shit on it. And go back in that hole. And tighten it down, hook it back up, and it should be good to go.